We're going to have a lot of fun now in Texas. Seventh inning snack series. Looking for the best food at baseball stadiums around the country. And Will Reeves at Globe Life Field in Arlington, home of the Texas Rangers. Good morning, Will. Hey, George. Good morning. This is a wild scene here at Globe Life. It's the newest stadium in all of... All right. We got it. We got it. Thank you, guys. We're very fired up here in Texas. This is the newest stadium in Major League Baseball. It's already hosted the World Series in the pandemic year. It's hosting the All-Star Game next year. And I'm joined by some great folks here. You've already heard the Arlington Youth Baseball Academy. They're fired up. These are the six shooters who've been dancing all morning. This is Captain the mascot. But we've also got a whole bunch of food. So take a look at the concessions that fans of the Texas Rangers love. At Globe Life Field, Texas Rangers fans are ready for game time. And hungry with a seventh inning itch for snack time. Meet Greg Gardner. He owns Cartel Taco Bar, a new pop up. So, this is our second time to be out here. The last time we were here, it was great. I mean, we ran out of product. Great crowds. On the menu, a twist on Tex Mex staples fajita and pulled pork tacos equipped with a full salsa stand. And these nachos. Delicious. <laughs> topped with a sweet and salty pineapple pico nacho cheese sauce. They're not ballpark nachos, they're you know, homemade queso with, with fresh pulled pork. And it wouldn't be Texas without some barbecue. This is Josh Ventola, the manager of Hurtado BBQ, a fan favorite. People try to get in and get those specials before we run out. There's usually a line the whole game. The joint started as a pop-up last year and now has its own full-time stand, serving slow-smoked Central Texas-style barbecue with a Tex-Mex vibe. Hurtado's the best. And proving that everything really is bigger in Texas, take a look at these massive smoked ribs. My favorite item is probably the brisket. Brisket, it doesn't need any sauce. It's great. It melts in your mouth. All right, we're joined by some great folks here, guys. You fired up? Yes, you are. We're, we're having a great time here. I'm joined by some really important folks. We've got Chef Chris Vasquez. He's the executive chef for the Texas Rangers. We've got Derek Brewster over here. He's the executive sous chef. But I am joined by a very special guest, Hall of Fame pitcher, Ferguson Fergie Jenkins. Mr. Jenkins, it's an honor to have you here. Thank you for being with us. You've got, you played for the Texas Rangers for a few years. You're still here in Texas. What is it about the Texas Rangers that keeps you here? Why is it so important to you? I think it's community. I, I've been uh, here for six years when I played in Arlington, and now I'm back for another three years. I live in Frisco. Okay, living in Frisco, but you're here with us at Globe Life. We really appreciate you being here, but we really, it's time to di dive into some food here. I hear everything is bigger in Texas. I see everything is bigger in Texas, Chef Chris. What is this? I'm told it's the Boomstick Burger, and it's two feet long, and you're going to sell 10,000 of them this year. What do we got? That's going to be over which, like I said, this is Texas size. Everything is big in Texas for me, of course, but <laughs> right. let's start getting this going. You know, we're going to be like a windshield wiper thing. Beef patty right here. That's on all top hamburger. Of potato. Okay. Bones. We're going to top it with so queso. Oh, very yeah, nice, like right? That. Oh, look at that. Yeah. We're going to do some little chili. Take, okay. Okay. That's chili? Texas chili, beef okay. chili, yeah. eh, jalapenos, eh. You have to have some jalapenos. Okay, jalapenos. jalapenos. And please, big baguette. You're All gonna right, we'll throw some, some onion onions. rings on there. You might as well just go crazy, yeah, go right? Crazy. If you're going to have a two-foot burger. Yeah. Okay, awesome. I'll let you, so I'll let you. Finish it up. Uh, okay, uh, like and then you just grab, oh, that's a hot plate. Okay, oh, no one told me that was hot. All right, we're going to move on. Uh, Chef, uh, Chef Derek, Texas, brisket, a natural pairing. Uh, croissant and brisket, not such a natural pairing. What is this? Well, brisket is king here in Texas, and we do a lot of it. Uh, we do about 1,000 pounds a day here at the ballpark. Uh, a little salt, a little pepper, a little bit of smoke, a little bit of thyme, about 12 hours on each one. Um, we put it in lots of different things. Here we're doing it with our brisket croissant and our brisket egg rolls, both big hits with the fans here at the ballpark. Okay, yeah. they look yeah. fantastic. And finally, that's a pretzel that looks really spicy, and that's a hot dog that also might be a pizza. Walk me through these. You know, baseball is all about the family. We want to be sure we take care of the dolls and on the kettle. So we got the pretzels, uh, top it out in, with some sprinkle hot Cheetos. Hot Cheetos oh, on a pretzel. Oh, you got a great nice. combination. Woo! And of course, you know, kids love pizza. And yes. We got a hot dog in the ballpark. We combine those two. We Excellent. got the pizza dog. Good stuff. Oh, yeah. All right, so we've got a bunch of great food here. We're going to dive in. I'm going to take a pizza dog. We're going to start passing it out one more time from the Arlington Youth Baseball Academy. Let's hear it from you guys. Yeah. we got the six shooters, Captain Chef Chris, 
Chef Derek and Fergie Jenkins, the Hall of Famer. It's a pleasure to be with you. It's time for us to eat, guys. You can eat these in any inning, but this is Seventh Inning Snacks. Go Red Go Red Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.